Hello and welcome back to some PvP War Skyblock. It has been a while. I'm going to go ahead and start off by just immediately creating my island because I'm very interested in checking these out. Oh, I kind of really like it. But I really want to see what the spaceship's like as well. Oh, that's really cool. I forgot that they added this. I did see this in the Discord. They added the ability or like the, um, the eye chest, something like that. That basically did what this is doing right here. Which is really freaking cool. Oh, that's right, I did check this out. I remember this at- My monitor just went black? That's not good. You know what, I'm gonna go with the pond because it actually looks really nice, and I didn't even make use of the spaceship the last time. It- It actually was more in the way, uh, if I'm being real. Oh, okay, so we got daily missions. Water- 5,000 seeds. I do have a key here, and I have more keys, actually. Let's see what we get. Okay, so we got a Crimson Key from that, and I think we got a Vote Key as well. We also have this Summer Wheel of Fortune spin, so let's go ahead and activate that. We'll check that out in a little bit. We've got three uh, v, or, v kit, G kit pouches here. Ooh, we finally got some new stuff. Well, okay, I can't look up and see it, but... Dude, that's awesome! Oh, I love that, actually. <laughs> okay, uh, we got a Cosmetic G kit pouch, which uh, gave us a knife chick spray what i had the lightsaber i don't know what happened to it this was the one i was looking for but magic staff beats it i'm sorry now they're definitely within the radius of this thing uh i want to see if i can kill them and see if this will collect any of their loot and then how it actually works i kill them i don't get the loot the loot goes in here they you you have more slots it's level one but you have more slots than you say oh i see that's because it says it right there slots three to four Bam. A basic pet pouch. Okay. Did they buff that? Because it used to be, like, candy or a pet. Alright, let's go open these keys and do the Wheel of Fortune. Actually, let's do the Wheel, uh, Wheel of Fortune first. I want to see what it has to offer, because we got that special one. Yeah, see, we got the normal premium, and then we got summer. Oh, they got rid of the other mob coins. That's actually kind of good. I like that. It simplifies it and just, it makes it a lot, a lot better. Let's open up our Summer Wheel of Fortune, or spin our Summer Wheel of uh, Fortune and see what we get. We got a Crimson Crate Key. That's actually pretty neat. I have all of the cosmetics in this, so that's useless. Six Crimson Keys. What do we get? Oh my. $50 million? Oh, oops. I was gonna, I was doing tutorial so we could... I don't think I'm gonna do the tutorial, actually. Okay. Never mind, I guess I'm locked into the tutorial. A lot of this I'm going to skip through because it just tells me stuff. Oh yeah, what about missions? Are missions different or are they the same thing? Same thing, okay. So this will show us some farms, some basic farms that we can do with the crop popper. Pretty simple. Um, I'm going to set something up like this eventually. I don't know how insane it'll be, but I'll figure it out. Skins, yes, like the one that I'm wearing that you guys can actually buy using slash goobits. Did I get that one? I could have sworn I got that one. No. I'm almost certain I had those, and I could probably... Actually, I definitely had those. Oh yeah, the dealer. I don't really like the dealer, if I'm being honest. He spawns in every 30 minutes to an hour, at random. He doesn't stay long, there's no announcement, you just have to find him, and it doesn't tell you where he's at. I hate him. Alright, well I guess all I have left to do is check out that beautiful new area that we have to explore and see what it has to, uh, or not. There is warp zone, so let's try that. Okay. Well, this took us somewhere for sure. Well, we can still chop these up. It just doesn't automatically go into our inventory, so we have to, like, actually manually pick it up, which is perfectly fine. Ooh, I leveled my pet up to 11. That's nice. Wasn't that one of my challenges? I have to level a pet up a lot? Gain 50,000 XP on a pet. Okay. Let's see. Now, I have a very important question. Can I chop anything in this area, or is there limits? Like, can I go to this? This one, okay, no. Oh, it's a big area. Okay, so we got some, like, wheat fields here, it looks like. Um, it looks like we might have more this way. What, what is, what is, what is the point in this area? Is this just decorative to look cool and maybe be used later, but... but how? There's no, there's no, like, story. There's no... There's no guidance. I mean, they kind of just backpedaled a lot of their features. I, I, I kind of get it. It looks like they're simplifying it a little bit. 
going back to the roots and then growing off of that, which is pretty cool. I guess I could go to my island and make some money, spend some money. I don't know, something. All right, I'm gonna build like a little bit of a platform. Um, I guess kind of around this. I also realize this isn't gonna work for all of my guys. Like obviously the blazes are gonna have to just exist, but I'm gonna have them drop down here anyways, and then I can always just drop down and kill them every now and then if I feel like it. I feel like that'll be good. I kind of like the idea of actually just incorporating stuff down here on the original island rather than doing what I always do where I go back up or go up to the very, very, very tippity tap of the sky and, and build it that way. All right, that's pretty good. Nice little addition to the island in general. I like it. Uh, let me go ahead and put that up and I guess, oh, actually I probably need those because I need to start building up to the very tippity tippity top. Oh, evokers, and they did not die, which means I need to go higher up. I mean, surely, right? Like, surely at this height? Well, I saw an evoker and a goat spawn in. I believe both of them died. And it looks like, yes, everything did die. Why did that not? Oh, I don't have enough slots for that. I gotta upgrade that a little bit. Yeah, sure, I kind of like that. This is a nice little area. I like this. I wish I could, I wish I could turn this, but... I'll deal with that later. It's pretty neat. All right, let's get this farm built. I want to build something simple. I, I guess... I mean, bamboo? I'm not going to build an automated farm yet. I'm probably going to do that in the future. Definitely going to need more dirt. Um, But I'm probably only going to build this one layer, and I'll fill in the rest in my free time. Because to be honest, I don't... Well, I don't have enough money and stuff. I mean, I probably could, but I, I honestly just... I just I'm going to do it later. I'll have to figure out exactly its range later on, but that's pretty damn good. I'm going to leave it there for now, and eventually I'll, I'll kind of just mess with it and, and figure it out down the line. But I can at least set up the basis of this. I forgot I had to be directly next to it, so I have to do water here too. I was trying to do a way where I could fly into it. There's definitely a way I can do that. Actually, I actually have an idea. I'm, I'm cooking a little bit. Uh, I should keep that there. Eventually, I'm going to get something automated set up, by the way. That's gonna be a thousand times better than this. But for now, this is what I got. So let's make ourselves a slab. And then I wanna build it kind of there. So I wanna be about that height. And essentially what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come down here, drop down, fly, and then all I have to do is just hold right and chop. And then I'll chop through all of that. And then I can do the same on this side. I'll just have to build it out. Of course, that's all I had for sugarcane for now, but I'll build it out, do that for a few layers. Uh, as many as I can up and down this area and all around. It's going to be fantastic. But that is it for PvP Wars Skyblock. If you guys want some more, let me know by leaving a like on this, commenting down below, and subscribing so you don't miss a video here on the channel. Make sure you join the server, by the way, guys. The server's just pvpwars.net, I believe. Should be down in the description, unless I forgot. But that's it. I'll see you guys in the next one.